Hello everyone. Today I am gonna tell you about NoSQL map. We all know SQL injection is favorite to all the hackers, but now we are in 2017. It's just not about SQL injection. In this era, many firms are using NoSQL databases. SQL map is an open source tool written in Python. It is designed for automation of injection attacks and exploit default configuration weaknesses in NoSQL databases as well as web applications using NoSQL in order to disclose data from the database. So for exploiting NoSQL databases, we use NoSQL map. NoSQL uh, we can say not only SQL. No SQL database provides storage and retrieval of data in the form of documents unlike SQL provides in tabular form in relational database. Okay, let me give you an introduction of SQL map. Let me log into my virtual machine Kylin. First of all, go to the GitHub page. Now open terminal and clone the file you can clone it anywhere for using git git clo any git clone and the url it's cloning Now go into the folder, no SQL map, ls for list. Now use python setup.py. I'm gonna attach the link for download in description. Python setup dot by hyphen hyphen help. Okay. Now search for command how to install this. Okay. Setup dot by install. Mm. Python setup dot by install. Okay. Installing. Yeah. You can directly use no SQL map dot py in your terminal or type the command Python no SQL map dot py. As you can see, it is a menu driven program. You need to set options like uh, set target host, set web app port, and then by saving you need to exit and then you need to select the mode no SQL DB access attack, no SQL web app attacks, or scan for anonymous. Okay, because there are some security issues, so I can't show you the whole working of no SQL map. This tool has some limitations like it can only abuse MongoDB but additional support for some other NoSQL based platforms such as Redis and Cassandra are planned in future releases. Okay, in the end of the video, I always told you something very very interesting. So, this time is for Tessel. Tessel is a microcontroller that runs JavaScript. It is used in building Internet of Things and now it is available for everyone. It runs using a super fast node engine developed by Google. I'm gonna attach some links in video description which could be very informative for every techie. If you are not a subscriber, so don't forget to subscribe. Please like, share, comment and subscribe.